Yeah. So now we'll talk about your <laughs> fight properly um, at one. I think you have two fights at one so far. And you fight yeah. the first guy was Sawada, I think, um, if uh, Japanese. And you dominated yes, that guy right. from start to finish. He, he, <laughs> at the point in time, he, does, he, he didn't want to be in that fight. He wanted the fight to be over, but we didn't let him go. Yeah. <laughs> he yeah, wanted to make so... a statement and show them that I'm here <laughs> and I'm right here to take over. So, yes, um, that's right. So yeah. as soon as I got into 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 one FC, they they offered me that fight, and he was on a three winning streak. So I knew it's gonna be a tough fight. You know, it's yeah. not just a walkover. So I got in there and told myself, I'm gonna I'm gonna give him hell. You know, <laughs> I'm gonna show him how it's done in the jungle. You know, and I just went there and just gave it all. And I just there were times he tried to take you down. You were about to take down. <laughs> Yeah, fight. I yeah. just had to, yes, he had very good hands, good takedowns, but I, I just figured a way to win in there. And yeah, that, that got me to fight the number three. Uh, number three guy who was supposed to yeah. fight for the belt. I think his name is Rene Catalan. The guy yes, you knocked down in the first round. So yes, the yes, highlight that went uh, across the world within hours. Yeah. So walk <laughs> yeah. us through that process. Tell us about the highlights and um uh, because I, I believe in the fight, you attempted that some kick and kick earlier, seconds before. Yes, kick, yes. But yes, you get it, yeah. connect. And you mentioned yeah. just before some minutes back that you were practicing for that technique going into the fight. Yes, so what was that's the right. Whole process. So, so what, what, what happened is um, I normally use my my striking to set up takedowns, and okay. that has always been my game plan. Started uh, starting with fight, and now. Everyone knew how good my takedowns were. So everyone is aware that I'm going to look for takedowns. I'm going to try to shoot. So what I had to learn was to also not just uh, set up my, my takedowns with striking, but set up my strikings also with takedowns. You know, fake for uh, to make contact or make contact and on that break, try to throw a strike, kick or hands. And which is something we practiced. We went yeah. over and over at the gym. Either I'm throwing the kick or I'm throwing hands yeah. or I'm, I'm making contact again. And I threw, I actually threw that kick a bit earlier, but I just, just missed. And um, a few seconds later, I was able to connect, to connect the kick, which yes. became my first knockout ever. Knockout, yes. And they are yes. amateur and pro. So it was something, wow. it was something great wow. for me. Wow. The video went viral, viral which, was, yes. which was quite good yes. for me. <laughs> yes. so it became good advertising for me and not just for myself, you know, but for African uh, mixed martial arts. Yeah. Um, yes, talking you know. about your knockout, the uh, highlight reel. What was the takeaway from the, from that knockout from that fight? Like you've not fought for two years now. Twenty twenty that was the last time you fought. Yeah. Not a year plus. Not two years. Yeah. So yeah, what's the takeaway yeah. from that fight? How motivated are you going to your next um, fight? In yeah. So every time I every every fight I take serious. You know. Um, yeah. You, you can't take any fight, especially at this level. You can't just take any fight like it, it's just walking in a park. And um, after my last fight, it built a lot of confidence for me. You know? um, the fact knowing that I've got a knockout power, which I never knew I had. Um, I okay. think it's also the fact that I've been fighting bigger guys, and now in one FC, you get to fight your guys your size. So it's giving me that um, that that. Uh, awareness of knowing that um, I can knock people out, I can I can wrestle them out, and um, it has boosted my confidence quite a lot. And I know going up to this fight against Jared Brooks, he's, he's a very tough uh, contender mm -hmm. and uh, he's a very good American uh, uh, wrestler. Uh, he also has a wrestling background. Mm -hmm. But, you know, I'm not there to, to take part. Uh, at the end of the day, I'm there to 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 get the title shot. Um, yes, I'm, the I'm there to, to wanna be. <laughs> yes, I'm there yeah. for the takeover. I wanna I wanna be the world champion. And Come on, Africans! Oh.